All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is my shop, and it is a complete mess. And this is a few discussion points for the live shop talk uh, coming up this Saturday. And I've been working on this, putting in 203 disc brakes, front, front and back. The main discussion point is I mounted a OKO uh, carburetor to the Minarelli and I used four set screws and I pocketed them into the intake. I wanted a rigid mount. The problem I was having with the other one was the intake uh, tube and what have you and several people said I should go to a 21 millimeter carburetor so this is what I did uh, but I didn't want any hose or anything in it flopping around so getting it sealed off where it's airtight is going to be very easy because what i'll be doing is i'll be taking some industrial uh shrink tube when i put it back on i'm gonna put a bead of silicone around the front of it and when i put the shrink tube on it it pushes silicone in so hard that it actually came out on the inside so i could go in there and clean it up now they've got chains all straight on that one and everything and I got the uh, 203 on it and I got the TO203 on the front. That was simply an adapter there. I had to make one for the back. And I'm just kind of bobbing around there, showing you this, showing you that. The shop is a total mess. I'm going to go out there today and clean it up, and get everything ready. And there's the shrink tube that I put on there. And I guarantee you there is no air leak on that carpet. Another thing that made me think I was getting an air leak was uh, my exhaust because that particularly didn't fit there. And you will get an air leak if you and we'll be discussing those right there too and uh i'm gonna ask i'm gonna ask five riddles and whoever gets the riddles right i will send you one of these absolutely free and they are very handy because the uh i use the butt end of them to help line up bolts and stuff like that so we'll see you all saturday and we're going to have some good discussions